Today, I will be using a dating app meant for fit people. You guys have seen it by now. I've done used a lot of dating apps on this channel. I reviewed a lot, I've tested a lot, but overall, I think this is the one I am most excited for. Why? Well, simply because I'm a fit guy. So why wouldn't I want to find a fit lady? To be honest, I attract a lot of thick, BBW, curvy, luscious woman, but today I'm feeling a little different. And what kind of sparked my interest was once again, I was scrolling on TikTok and I came across this ad. Let's watch it together. I just went on my first gym date. I met this girl named Anne on this app called Date Fit. You basically swipe right or left for gym partners. Y'all, gym dates might be the best thing in the world. Conversation is so easy in between sets. You get to motivate each other, see each other struggle, but most importantly, you break that awkward touch barrier immediately. <laughs> Anne even taught me how to do bikini poses. I'm telling you all, forget every other dating app. Date, date Fit. All right, Date Fit is where it's at. So fun fact, real quick, that's actually one of the gyms I work out at. And that girl actually follows me on Instagram and she always comments under my post. So um, she might, might find her own there. I might find some other baddies. Let's go ahead and see. We got to download the app. Let's go. So we're on the app store now. Let's go ahead and read it. Find dates and friendship through fitness. Healthy relationships start here. Whether you're a single or just looking to connect with other blah, 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 you have to come to the right place. It doesn't matter where you're at on your fitness journey. You're always welcome on date fit. So I'm curious, do they like not allow overweight or not fit people to be on the app? Let's go ahead and test it. Let's see if they're gonna scan us and make sure that we're fit. Who knows, because in that sense, it'll be a little discriminatory, right? We'll see. Open, don't allow, never allow dating apps to send you notifications. And let's go ahead and sign up. All right, I am here to meet singles to date fitness friends. I'm here to meet singles today. I am a man interested in women. Women. My number one life goal. Tell people what the one thing you achieve in your lifetime. God, number one life goal. Uh, unlimited freedom across all spheres of life. Everybody wants freedom. All right, let's go ahead and choose our picture. All right, chose my best picture. Let's see. And that's, that's a good one. I took that a few years ago. A little thirst trap showing the fitness side. <laughs> what is it when it came up? Make sure you have a six pack. Upload your shirtless picture. Okay, welcome to your daily workout. Each day, blah, blah, you're fit. Yeah, basically 10. Oh God, we're already rough start, man. Damn. All right, so you can set up your fitness interests, way of life interests, dietary interests. Let's see the fitness interests. I'm gonna put bodybuilding, uh, CrossFit. I feel like that would be a disqualifier in some cases. Like, oh, he likes CrossFit. Uh, yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna put. Way of life interest, mm, success driven, I like that. Dietary interest, dine out three times a week because Chipotle be taking my money recently, man. All right, we're not gonna do the rest of the stuff. Okay, here's how we added pictures. So we're gonna add this one. This is a super popular picture amongst the fitness crowd, especially gym girls. I'm definitely gonna put this one. We're gonna put this one to showcase and represent more of my fitness lifestyle. We're gonna put this one because as you guys should know by now, I'm the calisthenics king and I love doing handstands. Let's get it. Then we're gonna add one more. Let's add this one. This is something I've recently taken. Bam, so overall we got five pictures and I think it's looking pretty good. So the format is very interesting. It's like set up like an Instagram almost, like a, a Instagram. That's what it seems like, a, more like a social media sort of website. So, okay, so these are preferences. Three, four to eight, four. Max distance from me, let's go 100 miles, uh, 50 miles. You see, the reason why they had it set all the way because just in case there's not a lot of people using the app, you at least match with somebody who's in the other state, right? Uh, not interested in that. We gotta see who's in my area. Okay, I think our profile is set up all the way. On this side, we got our messages, and you can have friends, and then you go to singles. It's very interesting the way it's set up. And then in the middle is the discovery, where you discover people. So let's go ahead and see the quality of the app, because I know this is what you guys came for, to see the quality of the app in regards to me. Filter your feed anytime, see everyone, only men are just women. What the hell, we are not seeing everybody. No, just women. Bam, right there. 
and we're on the date part. All right, so uh, roll, I don't know how to pronounce the name, but let's see, you scroll, you don't swipe. What's going on here? I'm very confused. So you just scrolled and like liked their picture? Yeah, she's looking kind of, she, damn, I can't zoom on, on the pictures. But this is very interesting. So you don't swipe right or left. You kind of just scroll, it seems. And then if you like somebody, you can either like the picture or like initiate a message. Wait, what? In order to send a message, you gotta get premium. Direct messages anytime, know what you like, unlimited undos, never ending daily workout. Bruh, no thanks. So in order to message somebody, you gotta buy the stuff. And first off, I, I thought I was on Tinder for a second. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything, but. Mm, let's, let's keep scrolling, let's keep scrolling, we'll see. All right, I think she was the best one so far. Claire, let's go to Claire's profile. And we go to Claire. 140 miles away. Being able to spend all that space for my eye. So Claire's okay. Casey, 100 miles away. There we go, we got an IFBB pro chick. Definitely not my preference, but congrats to that. Hard work, man. Diana. Melanie, Jesus Christ, do you see how far these people are away? Let's start from right here, 250 miles away. 200, wait, no, 2,000, 2,000 miles away. 1,000 miles away, 800 miles away. Ooh, Amia, hello, Amia. I'm gonna send a DM, what's your IG? 19 years old, Bro, what? She is not even active on this what is happening, man? Uh, thousand miles away. You can only like it? Like, I literally can't send a message. Holy crap, guys. I'm not sure about the quality of this app. Mm -mm, nope. Veronica? Veronica's looking good. But 800 miles away? Where do you live? Does my phone think I'm in California? What is happening? Lately, I've been really into paleo, um, Kyle Hope novels. I read The Alchemist. That's a good book, by the way. When I was in college, but I'm excited to find that this other stuff is amazing too. If you have any book recommendations or fitness tips, send them my way. <laughs> well, Veronica, I got a few fitness tips I can coach you on. But the issue is I can't get in contact with you. What is that? Oh, like, just kidding. We don't like that. Never validate. All right. Uh, yeah. This is entirely depressing, guys. I truly think I'm better off just going on Instagram and going to the Explore page and sending out DMs, which are free, because one, it's not matching me with girls in my area, and two, not a lot of these girls are attractive. What the hell? Like somebody's first image is their current maxes for deadlifts, squat, bench, and cleans. What is, what is going on here? I think this is like a, reminds me of BLK, how you don't necessarily have to be the demographic that is trying to attract, example, like a fit person. But if you're attracted to fit people, this is where you go to find them, right? Don't discriminate, right? Okay, we're, we're gonna do a new game. I'm gonna swipe yes or, yes or no. Yes is swipe right, no is swipe left. Let's do it. No, no, hmm, breathe. That's a maybe, I need to see her body. Uh, no. Mm, that's why, right? Yes. Yes. Uh, no. Mm, he's got a little tool back there. Yes. Yes. No. Mm, yes. No. No. What the hell? Mm, yeah. Let's see Bobby. What's up with Bobby? Is anybody my age here? Can I? Okay, there we go. 24. No. Ah, uh, maybe. Uh, so the closest I think I'm getting is like 99 miles away, unfortunately. No. Yeah, guys. I'm sorry. Okay, Dimple. Let's, let's go with Dimple. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. This app is not it. Yep, not it, guys. If anything, they should at least be able to put their Instagrams or something in their bio. 
something to where you can at least message and like find them. But I didn't even see a, a place to put actual custom text. Like if you realize a lot of people don't have custom text on their stuff. Like what is going on here? Okay, easy going. Okay, they have custom text. But y'all need to put the IGs because I can't, I can't message you. All I can do is like. Like what's a like gonna do? And it looks like your, your lights could build up in some section of the app. Yeah, I'm immediately <laughs> about to <laughs> uninstall this, guys. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Overall, that was not a good app. I'm sorry, DateFit. Um, you guys put a lot of money probably into marketing for that video to be made, especially in Orlando, which I'm pretty curious on. But the system itself is very clunky hard to use, confusing. You can't even send messages without paying. All you can do is like. It's not very active. So overall, I would have to rate the app a solid one out of 10, guys. Not quality at all. And who knows, maybe one day we'll have like a solid fitness-based demographic sort of dating app that is actually useful and people actually use it and it's not clunky. Maybe one day. If you need help using your dating apps and using the best ones, not like that, then check out my Digital Romeo Mentorship down below where I teach you how to exactly present yourself online in the most attractive way possible while actually turning those matches into dates and by building your Instagram to have more social proof so that you can leverage that within your dating funnel. All links will be down below. You guys let me know, did I, did I miss an app that's fitness-based? Also, let me know what other apps you want me to do down below. I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Peace.